Hi, my name is Jeffrey. I'm an amateur audio engineer, and I'm kicking myself for having not found the Studio One feature sooner. I was working on a masking problem. That's where you have two instruments whose frequencies are colliding with each other. And generally what you do is use an EQ to try to balance them out. Well, I was watching some excellent videos from Sage Audio where they were using a fab filter EQ. And the cool thing was that they could show the spectrum analysis from each instrument on the fab filter EQ itself. Well, I didn't want to shell out 180 US dollars for another plugin. So the best I could come up with is essentially what you see here. I've got side by side, one channel going through this spectrum meter and through this EQ and the other one going through another spectrum meter and another EQ. And so I just sort of eyeball from one side to the other to see where the highs are, where they might be interfering with each other, and then trying to make the decisions and adjustments below. Well, this works all right, but I'll tell you what. Close your eyes and forget about what I've just shown you here. And now open your eyes and look at this. This is essentially what I was going for. I have these two channels down here. I just call them trumpet guitars and then trombone guitars. The EQ is actually on the trombone guitars, but there's a send coming from the trumpet guitars. It's being side chained into the EQ. And that's what you see here in the sort of fuchsia colored graph. And then the blue line is the trombone guitars, which is where this EQ is sitting. This helps me so much. And of course, you can duplicate it over on the trumpet guitars channel, for example, and then look back and forth. But at least you can see the two together. And you can see here where I saw these are running into each other and decided to lower the trumpet guitars a little bit. But I could boost that back up. Or we could turn it back on and crank it louder if we wanted to. And you can see it right there live. Okay, let me show you how to set this up. To sidechain an EQ, starting from scratch, first of all, let's add the EQ. So we'll add the Pro EQ in here. Okay, there it is. Play a little audio. Okay, that's these trombone guitars going through there. And now to sidechain it, we'll just go down here to Sends on my trumpet guitars, sidechains, and choose the trombone guitars Pro EQ. And that's it. It's so simple. I will tell you one thing. I've noticed every once in a while this seems to shut off. And when that happens, if I just toggle the sidechain button back and forth, then it'll come back. And of course, always use your ears instead of your eyes for the final adjustments. But there you go. I really wish I'd found this feature sooner. I hope it helps you. Again, this is Jeffrey. Happy mixing, my friends.